and send you home. That's so, that's surrealistic absurdity, absurd surrealism. So absurd surrealism now, absurd, surre, sur, abs, absurd surrealism is where this, the, the surrealism is, is absurd. There's an absurdity to the surrealism. Like let's say I have an ice cream hammer. I saw an art, surrealistic art where this person juxtaposed a hammer and an ice cream and he called it an ice cream hammer. So that is surrealistic, that, that, that's absurd surrealism. So surrealism is a fascinating phenomenon in art. You have the three-dimensional aspect of art, you have the, the, the surrealistic aspect of art, and then you have colors, and then you have shades, you know. So, and there's a lot of things that happen in art. Your visualization becomes more stronger. You understand, you get a deeper understanding of physics, and you begin to become much more aware of a peculiar, tiny little peculiarity in nature that we tend to that's be jaded to. That's oblivious to our, uh, our vision. That only becomes clear when we start to look at art. We realize that the things that we very seldom see or take for granted are conducive or contingent on this three-dimensional depiction on a two-dimensional surface. So, um, that's my introduction to my, why, my, in fact, why, my, in fact, why, why am, I am infatuated with art. And as you all can see that my ability to create art has increased exponentially. You know, I do.